About 10% of babies are born preterm. Of that, about a million die every single year. For every one degree a child loses, they increase their chance of mortality by 28%. So you want to try and do something to help, you think there's got to be a better way to do it. My mom in the 1960s was born preterm, but she was lucky enough back then to be able to access one of the first you know, incubators in the country. And without one, I, I wouldn't be here. I'm a product designer by training. Solving problems is at the heart of everything that we do. I did quite a bit of research into what the problems were with current systems and came up with the idea for a collapsible, inflatable incubator. So the MOM incubator is an accessible solution that provides flexibility to a nurse, a midwife, a clinician to give incubation wherever it's needed, whether that be in hospital transport, transitional care, rural health care, in pediatric a &E, or even standard of care in parts of the world. The main thing the incubator does, which is the same as any other incubator, is that it can maintain a high spec, thermally stable, warm, safe environment for a newborn. But everything else about our incubator is different. It can pack down to half its size and it's only 20 kilograms, which makes it extremely portable so that a newborn can be easily transported so it can stay close to its parents. Our incubator is very energy efficient and it runs off only 100 watts when it's in steady state, so that massively reduces its carbon footprint. We added a backup battery to our incubator, which means it's great for intra-hospital transport. Similarly, in low resource settings where the power isn't as reliable, if the power drops, the incubator's backup battery can kick in, ensuring that the care of the infant never stops. You might have the most amazing thing ever, but if someone can't use it, no patient is going to ever benefit from what you're doing. But when you actually put it into the real world, it needs to be easy to use. So the Sustainable Innovation Fund really helped us get this product in front of users. It helped us build the instructions that we actually need to use the product. The funding enabled us to get the usability study. We made so many improvements based on the feedback from the end users. And then the second thing we were able to do was get our incubator into a clinical setting and get that first baby in the incubator, which really was incredible. Our daughter Robin was born prematurely and um, after about a month in intensive care, we were asked to take part in the mom incubator trial. Robin was the first ever baby to use this for about 48 hours, which was amazing and proved that it was a success after her trial. It had everything she needed, it was just really compact. It had an inflatable side, so um, it would be really protective um, for the babies on the inside. From our experience, seeing how well Robin did in the trial of the mom incubator, we could see how um, it could benefit other premature babies, ultimately keeping them safe and warm and, in, in many cases, alive. It was very rewarding having something that was literally a, a sketch in your desk go through a, a huge amount of iteration to become a, a product that is actually impacting children's lives as we speak. We want to get this out into lots of hospitals throughout the UK, but ultimately this is about getting it all around the world, internationally, trying to help hundreds of thousands, if not millions of kids, putting a stamp into neonatal care everywhere, giving them a great higher tech solution that they deserve and they need.